Hey everybody, welcome to the VIP Financial Education YouTube channel. My name is Matthew and I'm here to help you go further, faster financially. And there is some big, big news coming out of Washington this week with recent developments in the student loan debt relief provided by the Biden administration. I'm definitely curious to hear your thoughts on this topic at the end of the video, put them in the comments below, but the White House has now announced that an additional 125,000 student loan borrowers have been approved for debt relief, totaling $9 billion in forgiveness. This announcement came shortly after the resumption of federal student loan payments at the beginning of the month, following a pause that lasted over three years. Despite the Supreme Court's dismissal of President Biden's student loan forgiveness program, which aimed to offer up to $20,000 to low and middle income borrowers, the administration has been actively exploring other avenues to provide debt relief. The recent cancellations stem from three existing debt relief programs that have encountered challenges in the past. The White House has recognized the need to address these major issues, which there clearly are, within the student loan system, and it's working towards implementing effective solutions. So among the beneficiaries of these debt cancellations, an additional 53,000 borrowers will receive relief through the Public Service Loan Forgiveness Program, and that's the program that erases remaining student loan debt for qualifying public sector workers that have made 10 years worth of monthly payments on time. Furthermore, approximately 51,000 borrowers who have been in repayment for at least 20 years will also receive relief after a recount of their past payments. These borrowers had already qualified for student loan forgiveness, but were previously overlooked due to administrative errors. Additionally, 22,000 borrowers with total or permanent disabilities have been approved for automatic debt discharge through a, a data match with the Social Security Administration. So let's discuss the overall progress and the impact here. The White House states that uh, these new discharges bring the total approved debt cancellation to $127 billion for nearly 3.6 million borrowers during President Biden's term. In addition to debt relief, the Biden administration has also taken steps to ensure affordable monthly student loan payments. This month, approximately 28 million borrowers will resume making payments after account freezes were implemented under the Trump administration to assist those facing financial hardships that were caused by COVID-19. The administration has also introduced repayment programs that are aimed at reducing the financial burden for millions of borrowers. Furthermore, a Department of Education rule set to be effective next year has been developed to regulate tuition in for-profit colleges and career programs. All these sound pretty favorable to me. So where does that really leave everybody for future plans with debt relief? Well, the administration is actively exploring the possibility of additional pathways for student debt relief. One potential program being considered would cater to specific groups of borrowers who have seen their balances grow higher than the original borrowed amount despite making regular payments. And I see that regularly within my coaching sessions. However, this pathway does require the Department of Education to undergo a formal rulemaking process, which typically takes time and it may of course encounter legal challenges. Biden is expected to provide additional updates on this stuff, guys, uh, in, or, you know, in his efforts to cancel student loan debt. So make sure you do subscribe to the channel for more updates and information. I'll bring those to you when we have them, including how student loans will continue to affect this extremely volatile economy as a whole. It will affect everybody regardless of whether or not you have student loans. So until we see you on the next video, make it a great day today and keep on cash flowing. Take care.